You should feel great about yourself. You're doing this amazing independent thing. Monica, what is so amazing? I gave up, like, everything. And for what? You are just like Jack. Jack from downstairs? No, Jack and the Beanstalk. <laughs> ah, the other Jack. Yeah, right. See, he gave up something, but then he got those magic beans. And then he woke up, and there was this, this big plant outside of his window full of possibilities and stuff. And he lived in a village, and you live in the village. <laughs> okay, but Phoebes, Phoebes, Jack gave up a cow. I gave up an orthodontist. Okay, I, I know, I know I didn't love him, but... Oh, see, Jack did love the cow. <laughs> but see, it was a plan. You know, it was clear. Everything was figured out, and now everything's just kind of like... Floopy? Yeah. <laughs> Look, you're not the only one. I mean, half the time, we don't know where we're going. I mean, you just got to figure at some point it's all going to come together, and it's just going to be... unfloopy. I feel like that's a word. <laughs> Okay, but Monica, what if, what if it doesn't come together? Phoebes? <laughs> well, because you just... I, I don't like this question. <laughs> okay, see, see you guys? What if we don't get magic beans? I mean, what if all we've got are... beans? I'm so sorry, you guys. I didn't mean to bring you down. No, you were right. I don't have a plan. Uh, pizza guy. Oh, thank God. Phoebe? What? Do you have a plan? I don't even have a plan. <laughs>